All right, thanks, guys. The Pods take on the Cubbies. 220 East at Wrigley Field. The Cubs are the $2 favorites. No posted total as of yet. 80% are leaning towards Chicago. We got Tyson Ross for the Pods. Jose Quintana for the Cubbies. Chicago's 3-1 heads up against the Padres. San Diego's just 34% as the underdog. 3-1 to the over in these teams for head-to-head matchups. Got to fade the early betters in this one. Give me the Cubbies getting the job done on the run line. And welcome to the show. Got some lines and personal leans for you for Friday's MLB action. But before we get into that, I just want to remind you to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash Brock Page with a documented win percentage of 60% for the entire year of 2017. You're hurting yourself each and every day. You're not subscribed. Packages begin at just $1.99 a month. There's also plenty of free content there as well. So once again, please feel free to check me out at patreon.com slash Brock Page. I also want to give a quick shout out, a big thank you to my headline sponsor for today's program. That's Jimmy and the boys at ghostpicksats.com. And if you like making money on sports, there's no reason why you shouldn't check out one or more of their very affordable money-making packages. That's Jimmy and the boys at GhostPicksATS.com, GhostPicksATS.com. And without any further ado, let's go ahead and take a look at our Friday slate of baseball games and personal leans. All starts Eastern Standard Time. And on deck, we got Marlins, Phillies, 705 Philadelphia. The Phils are $1.65, totals 8.5, 20 cent fade of the Phils in the early going here. We got Richards for the Fish, Velasquez for the Fightins. The Phils are 11 and 3 at the money line price. They're also 24 and 9 as the official home favorite. Phillies going 21 and 12 to the under, taking on sub 500 teams. Got to fade the early betters in this one as well. Give me the Phillies run line in the under eight and a half. Next game: Cardinals Pirates 705 Pittsburgh. The Pirates are $1.55 totals eight flat. 68% are leaning Pittsburgh. We got John Gant for St. Louis, Chris Archer for the Buccos. The Pirates dropped two of their last three and four out of their last seven. They've also gone 11-5 to the over following a day off. Cards games went 3-1 to the over in their last four themselves. Got to fade the public on this one. Give me the underdog Cardinals catching the plus money in the over. Eight flat. Next game, Reds Nationals 705 Washington. The Nats are a buck 75, totals nine flat, 82% are leaning Washington. We got Di Slafani for the Reds, Gonzalez for the Cardinals. Washington's 3-1 and one head-to-head with the Reds, since he's just 40% as the underdog. Reds are 8-2 and two to the over when Di Slafani throws the first pitch. Got a side with the public on this one as well. Give me the Nationals outright in the over, nine flat. Next game, Yankees, Red Sox, wild one last night, 7-10 Boston. The Yankees are $1.30, totals 8.5, 72% are now leaning Boston. We got Louis Severino for New York, Rick Porcello for Boston. The Bo Sox are just 20% at the current money line price. Yankees are 82% when Severino makes the start. New York's also 13-4 and four to the under on the road when the line was 8-8.5. Eight to eight and a half. Got to fade the public here. Give me the Yankees outright in the under. Eight and a half. Next game, Braves-Mets. 7-10 flushing Queens. The Mets are $1.30. Totals, seven flat. 69% are leaning Atlanta. We got Sanchez for the Braves. DeGrom for the Mets. New York's won just 8 of 21 when DeGrom makes the start. Atlanta's gone 10-3 and three in their head-to-head matchups with New York. DeGrom starts and went 14-7 and seven to the under. Got to tell the public on this one. Give me the Braves catching the plus money and the under. Seven flat. Next game, Rockies, Brewers. All the way down there. 8-10 Milwaukee. The Brewers are a buck and a quarter. Totals eight and a half. 70% are leaning Milwaukee. We got Marquez for the Rockies. Guerra for the Brewers. Milwaukee's 20-10 and 10 as the official home favorite. Colorado's dropped three of four head-to-head matchups with the Brewers. 13 out of 20, Junior Guerra starts, stayed under the line. Got to tell the public once again, give me the Brewers outright in the under 8.5. And, 
Next game, Royals, Twins, 8-10 Minnesota. The Twins are $1.75, totals down to 9 flat. 71% are leaning Minnesota. We got Heath Fillmeyer for the Royals, Jake Odorizzi for the Twins. Minnesota's 552 in their games at home as the home favorite. KC's just 29% in their games as the dog. Odorizzi starts went 13 and 9 to the under this year. Got to take the public side on this one. Give me the Twins outright in the under, 9 flat. Next game, Giants, Diamondbacks, 940 Arizona. The D-backs are $1.85, totals 8 flat, 73% are leaning D-backs. We got Stratton for San Francisco, Corbin for Arizona. The D-backs are just 25% in their games at the current market price. San Fran's 11-7 when Stratton makes the start. The D-backs are 64% to the over in their second game without a day off. Got to fade the public on this one. Give me the underdog Giants catching the plus money and the over. Eight flat. Next game, Tigers A's 10.05 Oakland. The Athletics are $1.75. Totals nine. 76% are siding with the A's. We got Hardy for the Tigers. Anderson for the Athletics. Oakland's won an incredible 90% of their ball games played at the current money line price. There were also 738 in their games versus sub-500 teams. Six out of eight Anderson starts all fell under the line as well. Got to tell the public here, give me the A's outright and the under. Nine flat. Next game, Astros-Dodgers, 10-10 Los Angeles. The Astros are $1.10, totals down to seven flat, 69% are on Houston. We got Verlander for the Strohs, Alex Wood for the Dodgers. But despite scoring three touchdowns last night, the Dodgers still dropped three out of their last five ball games. Houston's 37 and 17 away from home. Houston's 5 and 0 to the under on the road when the line was seven flat. Got to tell the public on this one. Give me Verlander getting the W in the under seven and flat. Next and final game for the show, it is going to be Blue Jays Mariners. That's 10 10 Seattle. The Mariners are a buck 60, totals down to eight flat, 78% are leaning Seattle. We got Baruki for the Jays, Gonzalez for the Mariners. Seattle's a solid 23 and 9 as the home favorite. They've also gone 15 and 6 when Marco Gonzalez starts on the bump. Oddly enough, Seattle's just 37% to the over versus teams allowing more than four runs per contest. Got to tell the public betters here. Give me the Mariners outright and the under eight flat. And that is going to do it for me here for our Friday slate of MLB games and personal leans. But before I get out of here, I just have to remind you to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And with a documented win percentage of 60% for the entire year of 2017, you're hurting yourself each and every day you're not subscribed. Packages, uh, packages, excuse me, let's try that again. Packages begin at just $1.99 a month. There's also plenty of free content there as well. So once again, please feel free to check me out at patreon.com slash Brock Page. And I also want to remind you to check out my headline sponsor. That's Jimmy and the boys at ghostpicksats.com. Jimmy and his team of young, hungry, expert consultants at Ghost Picks are the most passionate in the business. And if you thought I was good at handicapping games, these guys are amongst the best in the industry. And as always, thank you for watching today's program. Just want to quickly recap what we have here. We leaned toward the Cubbies getting the job done on the run line. We had Phil's run line. We had Cardinals underdog catching the plus money. We had Nationals outright. They were favored in that one. We also had the Yankees outright bouncing back from a tough loss last night. We have the Braves catching the plus money as the underdog. We have Brewers outright over the Rockies at home there. Uh, the Rockies are on the road. The Brewers are at home there. We also have the Twins getting the job done over the Royals. We also have the uh, Giants catching plus money there. So a good mix of favorites and underdogs. Um, also a lot of tailing of the public here for me. Normally I fade the public, but, uh, I was on, uh, on the public better side here. We also have the A's outright 
And then when it comes to this Astros Dodgers game, we are leaning Verlander getting the W. That's a Verlander play. And finally, the Mariners outright. All right, folks, that is going to do it for me. Like I said, as always, thank you for watching today's program. I hope you enjoyed all this great free information. And please don't forget to check out my daily best play at patreon.com slash brockpage.